Hey guys, welcome back to Twitch Plays XCOM Enemy Unknown, where if we have a little look over here, we are in big, big trouble. Uh, India is very, very panicked, and we have absolutely no satellites to be able to launch. Not only do we not have the satellites to be able to launch, but we don't actually have the space to launch them. Uh, well, we do have space for one, so we could solve India if we had a satellite. The problem with that is if we come back to our main screen here, uh, expand the event list, you can see that we have a council report in 10 days, and our satellite's not ready until 20 days. So, I have a feeling we're going to lose India, but what, what can we do about that? I, I don't actually know what we can do about that, so I think we're going to have to just go to Mission Control and scan for activity. Now, this is the first time I've recorded with this microphone, so I'm kind of hoping that everything is, got, is going to be okay. I am worried about sort of feedback from my, my speakers into the microphone, so if you hear any of that, please do let me know, but I'm trying to keep the levels low um, specifically for those reasons. So let, let's have a look at these uh, site lab results, shall we? No one's got the gift. This seems to be a, a, a recurring theme. I know I'm only doing rookies, but that's because the two well-trained guys that I did have, I've put in here, and they came back with no gift as well. So we've just got to carry on putting in rookies, I'm guessing. Uh, so let's go into the side lab. Add, add soldier. Uh, why have you got an upgrade thingy? I don't know, but let's, let's try this guy. Uh, and then maybe um, Heather Porter. Yep. Doesn't sound like Harry Potter at all. And maybe... I don't know. Do we need a sniper? Do we need the support? I'm wondering why we've got this guy. I'm also wondering where all our people are. Uh, we need a few more people to actually put into this thing. So let's. Uh, we can't any hire any more soldiers, can Commander, we? We could get four more soldiers. We've suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. Yes, we do, but uh, the, the main problem is I don't know if we can fill the squad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. May maybe, maybe. Uh, we could put one more person in, but I'm not sure who... We're, we're just going to leave it with these two. We're just going to leave it with these two. And now, finally, we're going to go through these times. Um, the council report is coming up fast. This this worries me, um, mainly because uh, we're going to say bye-bye to, to India now, right? Commander, yeah, look at that. Unfortunately, one of our members has chosen to discontinue their involvement in the XCOM project. Boo hiss! I dislike this, but, you know, there we go. Work, Commander. This council is pleased to see our continued support of this project has been worthwhile. We hope that your current successes only mark the beginning of an enduring effort to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. Yeah, yeah, what, what, what you say is marks the beginning, despite this being like the worst period we've ever had. But yeah, we get a lot of money, we've got all these things done. Is it me or are we starting to like whir down a little bit now? I, I, I feel so. In touch, Commander. Yeah, I know you're going to be in touch and unfortunately this... Oh look, uh, Kix is back, that's good. Uh, do we continue scanning? We, we, nothing else we can do. So they request four plasma pistols. We don't actually have them, but we can get eight gra uh, 800 from it. So let's go see how much four plasma pistols is actually going to cost us to make. As we have new engineers quite a bit of money. Morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Yeah, I'm sure you are. What, well, what are we looking for? It's going to be here somewhere. Plasma sniper? Plasma pistol. Uh, we want four of them at 69. Uh, yeah, no, that's, that's, that's good monies. Good monies. Two, three, four... Submit that order. Awesome. So if we come back and do this thingy over here, where is it? No, it wasn't here. It must have been in the situation room. I remember how to play this game. Honestly, really. It's the uh, so like yeah, I, I, like I had four four or five days of not recording because obviously my microphone had broken, so everything was very bad there. But no, hopefully everything's all right now. Hopefully everything's all right now. Everything should be done. I I am so gutted we've lost India. Does this mean we're going to lose almost all of um, Asia like one after the other? I don't know, we'll see. I, it is kind of the area that I neglected, unfortunately, which is a little bit of a shame. It's more than a little bit of a shame, it's a lot of a shame. But look at all these credits we have to spend. We can, like, really kick people out. Hope, hopefully, we can really kick people out. But we are waiting for stuff to happen so we know how to kick people out, right? Um, I don't think we've got much more. What is this? We onto something, Commander. Our latest candidate is different. Different. We're picking up levels of psionic energy unlike any we've detected in the previous test. This is good. This is good. Uh, let's see. Who, who's got it? Who, who's got the psionic testings? Oh, that, everyone is watching. Hello, number two. How are you doing? Oh, you got number two on your back. <laughs> uh, so what? Just lock him in that thing? Looked up at the stars. We have wondered what lies beyond. So very few have dared to look. 
The depths of the human mind hold more secrets than we can possibly imagine. How ironic that the means to defeat our enemy comes not through weapons or machines of war, but from the sea. Wow, look at her. And if we have succeeded... She doesn't look happy. We will have gained a glimpse of what we are to become. We will have created something. Okay, so we have one person with side powers, right? Could we, do, we, do we have to make give them, like, Psy, psy armor? I saw the psionic armor was a thing. Uh, psionic experimentation has revealed that one of our soldiers has psionic powers. Yeah, to view available psy training, go to the barracks and grant this soldier psy promotion. New psionic training options become available as the soldier uses psy abilities in combat. Oh, that, that's what we're going to have to do. Rookie Heather Porter, better than our sergeant. Look at that. Okay. Uh, so, what? In here, what is it, the officer training school? Is that the one? No, but don't die on me is something we definitely need to get. There we go. Brilliant. That, that, that was definitely something we wanted. Uh, the, view, view the Psy Labs. No, this is for putting people in. This is not what we wanted to do. I'm sure it said somewhere that we were supposed to do stuff. Literally just read it. Hire soldiers, visit the Psy Labs. Officer training school, we literally just come from here. Uh, soldiers. No, no idea. Let's go in and, and level up this guy. Hey, you, uh, Captain Hassan Adram. Uh, smoke grenades. I swear we only get like two or three companies, uh, not companies, um, two or three families applying to come and be part of our team. Like, how many Adrams have we seen now? Uh, I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce that, but that's just like, what we're going for. Uh, covering fire, what are you? You're a support officer. So, covering fire or sprinter. I'm going to go with uh, covering fire. Are you sure? No. Uh, reconsider. Is that the this side? Uh, on enemy attacks, not just movement. That's the one we want. Yep. Confirm. Uh, Sergeant, you're going to have smoke and mirrors allows the use of one smoke grenade. No, no, we're going to go for the extra many packs, of course. Uh, allows medicates to revive critically wounded soldiers at 33 instead of just stabilizing them. That would be particularly useful. Confirm that one. Brilliant. Dense smoke uh, or combat drugs. Smoke grenades now contain powerful stimulants that grant, uh, grant a 20% will and 10% critical chance. For, there we go. We'll go with that one. Confirm. We should use the smoke grenades more often. So this guy is going to be our, like, backup support guy all the time. That'll be good. Hey, excuse me. So, who is... This This is our Psy training person. Let's, let's have a look. Let's go in here. Psy abilities. Yeah. Training. Mind fry. Okay. Use Psy abilities in combat to unlock further Psy ability training. Causes target to lose grip on reality. Inflicting penalties to aim, will, and mobility. And doing five base damage. Robotic units are immune. Last two turns. But it's got a one-turn cooldown. Okay, we can do that. Definitely within our realms of possibility. This is a girl who's going to be on it on it a lot. Heather Porter. Harry Potter. I think we might have to name her name, uh, change her name. So we're definitely going to be sending her out. Let's let's carry on watching time. Watching time. Uh, in fact, whilst we're here, I want to go to the engineering and I want to go to the facilities. To prepare these soldiers for the changes, permanent changes that they will experience. Uh huh. Stuff like that. What I want to do is remove this foundry and pop it down here. Really, right? How long is that going to take? Brilliant. So what we're going to do is put a satellite uplink. Is that the best one we can do? I'm sure there's like a satellite nexus. That's what we want to do. Um, capable of four satellites. That's that's what, what we want. Brilliant. Begin the construction. Do it. Awesome. And we're going to move the foundry down here. Oh, it's an excavation. Dang it. Didn't want to do that. Let's put the foundry over this side. I mean, I put it next to the workshop in case it would get like some sort of... Um, you see, like we've got the pluses here. Some... some Synergy with it, but it doesn't seem to have it at all. So that's that's no good. I'll put it next to the workshop. Nope, no good. We're gonna build it here. This is this is a good place to put it. Where is it? The foundry. Not that I ever used the foundry. Um, yeah. Well, there we go. Mark it in the history books. This is the end of an era for mankind. Even after we've defeated the remaining aliens, what then? Have we sacrificed our own humanity for a taste of their technology? And if we manage to exploit this power further, do we risk being consumed by it? That's Presumably deep for a sheen. Just as they were? Well, I mean, are the aliens, like, consumed by their technology and that's why they're coming after us? Or is it just a fact of, like, they want our water? Might be. But th then again, if they were after our water, why would they be coming to Earth? Like, there, there's all this water up in, like, Europa and Enceladus and places like that. Once again, I'm not sure what this... this is this the places that aren't in my thing? Complete. Abduction reports, here we go. Oh my gosh. Requests for assistance. Japan or Argentina? Are well, Blates were going for Japan because we know this is the area with like all the difficulties. So let's come in here. Now, we want to get rid of someone, right? 
Who are we going to get rid of? We're not getting rid of Kicks, and we're not getting rid of... Oh, maybe Sergeant Edwards? Uh, this guy over here, he, he looks to be unuseful. He's just a standard support. Is he the guy that... Edram, yeah. Is he the guy that we've been doing normally? Uh, I'm not sure who to get rid of. I'm not sure who to get rid of. Like, if this guy is the support that we've just done up, maybe we want him over him. Um, let's have a look at this guy. Let's see what we've got. Uh, what abilities are you rocking, my friend? Yeah, no, we're gonna we're gonna get rid of you. We get, first thing we're gonna do, no, not that. It goes to the loadout. We're just gonna give him some basic stuff to get rid of all the good stuff. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we will give him the light plasma rifle instead. Okay, that's all good. And then we're gonna clear him, and we're gonna move in Heather Potter or whatever her name is. We'll, we'll have to go through and change her name. Um, going to edit the unit we need to edit your loadout this is the the thing we really need to do now do we want the ghost armor the archangel the titan i mean the titan armor is pretty good hp is 10 what about the ghost armor oh defense goes up what's hmm maybe i want my defense up so let's see we've got 10 xp there uh, 10 HP there, but there's 6 there. I'm going to... Uh, you know what? I'm going to go with the ghost armor. I think that, I think this is the way to go. Uh, in fact, doesn't she have, like, some psi armor? Anyway, let's come back. 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 All the way back. We want to go to engineering. Command. We want to go to buy items. At this point, a foundry was yeah, yeah, I know. We're, we're building the foundry. The but what I'm looking for is the psi armor. We're equipment. short of Illyrium. Oh, my. What? How much... Rather we've only got 6 left. It must have been all those plasma pistols. I didn't even keep track. Oh, man. Well, here we go then. We're just going to have to do it as we're doing it. Uh, Japan, right. Okay, we're just going to have to go with that, maybe. Uh, edit the unit. We want to load out. We want to put you in Titan armor. That is a must. And we also want to give you a plasma rifle. Uh, can't do any better there. But you are our support guy. So what we really want to do is give you all the way down here, medikits. Bam. Job done. Okay, this this new guy, girl, whatever. Um, no, we don't want psi abilities. That's definitely not one. We don't want this, uh, the loadout. We're going to give her a plasma rifle. Done. We're also going to give you... No, <laughs> didn't click done. How useless. Uh, plasma rifle. Done. Okay, there we go. Uh, can't give you a pistol. Okay, I think... Looking around... Is that a... What, you, what, what weapon are you carrying? Is, there, is everyone carrying plasma apart from this guy? This guy's got the laser, which is a little bit could do with, could do with another sniper. Uh, yeah, sniper rifle. I don't know. Let's have a look. Someone, someone had a sniper. There we go. That should be good. Okay, I, th I think we're there. I'm just going to hit launch. We've already taken like 13 minutes to get this done, so let, let's let's get rolling. Let's get rolling. Probably going to be like a 40 minute episode or something like that. Like, <laughs> I've watched myself come out to these things 15 minutes into the episode yeah, before. It takes a while. Alright, we are setting down. It's the Sky Ranger coming in 5 by 5. Operation Lost Calm. Um, we are in. Oh, uh, Nagoya? Something like that in Japan. It appears to be a construction site. So, this is all good. This is all good. So here we come, coming down heavy. Uh, once again, the four people coming out when we know we've got six, but, you know, whatever. We'll, we'll just make do with these. Um, oh, this looks good. Okay, so we're coming through uh, sort of a doorway here, and then we're spreading out into a relatively compact area. Okay, so what, what are we going to do? I think I'm going to go take position against here. It might be too far, it might be great. Eyes on yeah, no, there we go. Right, so now we just kind of fall back and get everyone in a beautiful position for an ambush. I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do here. Ideally, we're going to use our... Oh, look at that. I'm going to fire that at him. 100%, 30% crit damage. Let's do that. That is how you take one down. You know, come a little bit closer and then my sniper can have you. Come on, just... just uh, let me get a little bit more? A little bit more? Can we go a little bit more? Okay, Heather Porter, she actually really needs to get in and, and have some of this. Um, perhaps here is a good place. We get her in, we shoot with the plasma rifle, we kill this guy. And... Oh, no, we didn't want to do that. Well, this not so great, but hopefully we're going to have guys that can deal with that. Uh, so let's, let's deal with this first. This should be a death. Okay. That's good. Now, what we want to do is use guys like this to be able to come in here. Uh, I'm, I'm really worried about the Muton just kind of grenading my guys. Uh, I think you'll understand why I'm worried about that. Uh, let's have a pop at him. 
Is this my big one? Uh, yeah, ah, oh, terrible shot range though. Hopefully he's going to come down from here. Go on, come here. Who's panicked? You took a step forwards out of cover to do that, did you? That, that would be pretty terrible. Headshot on this guy, hopefully. He's pretty close. Can't shoot anybody else, though. Um, let's try it. Double tap? Does this guy have double tap? I don't know. Oh, missed. Uh, kicks. You, my friend, come in here. And you're going to just fire at him. 94%. Hopefully this will be a good takedown. No, no, not a good takedown. It's a shame we um, got both of them activated. Two pods there. That, that was a bit of a shame. Takes a reaction shot. Go on, do it. Yeah, okay. So, could have been worse. Could have been worse. I believe we've got one guy left. Have we? Have we got one guy left? Who's this? There we go. Okay, brilliant. Uh, we can't do this without a dash, though. That's a problem. Um, perhaps what we want to do is come in here and then smoke grenade these two. I'm kind of feeling that. Are you feeling that? I'm feeling that. Let's do that. Let's come in here. Let's ready our smoke grenade. Could probably have used more smoke grenades. Uh, and something like there. That, that that should be good, right? We'll see. We'll see what happens. This is the best we can do as an opening gambit. Gambit, I think. We'll just, we'll just have to see. Okay, so the muton. I don't know. Seems to just be getting crazy. Is he going to move? Is he going to shoot? Is he going? Yeah, he's grenading. This was my big worry. Um, it was it was getting that second guy um, activated. That that really. Oh no! And here they all come. What is this? Why does this always happen to me? I just keep, keep getting swamped at the beginning. Um, see now, a rocket would do just wonders there, wouldn't it? We'll, we'll see if we can bust out a rocket at some point. No, leave me alone. I said leave me alone. Okay, what, what can we do about that? What can we do about that? He's panicked, so let's see what he does. Is he going to run away? Is he not? Uh, Pedersen, you know what your job is. You come up here... He says he's uncovered with that. Perhaps a running gun. I mean, this just seems so far away. But is anyone else going to actually be up here? I don't know. Maybe over here and that will um, pop everyone out. Uh, this seems bad. This seems bad. Perhaps. No, that doesn't seem any closer. This is the problem. Maybe what we want to do is use this one. Can you come down here and shoot that one? Is that a thing? 35, 35, no, that's rubbish. Maybe we can use our Psy powers, Mind Fry. 8% uh, hit chance. Let's try this one. Mind Fry on him. Was that good? Was that bad? I don't know. I don't know what's happened. Uh, okay, let's just fire it. 58, do we have anything better than a 58? No, they're all 58, so let's just try this first one. Uh, hopefully this is a death. Ah, oh, come on. Snipers, like, excel at this stuff. Why aren't you doing it? Um, right. Kobayashi, Mr. Kicks. Let's do you a run and gun. Yeah, no, you are the man. Um, you're going to come out here. Yep, good run. Good run. And then we're going to fire at him, hopefully for some death. Yeah, that, that was some death. That was some good death. Okay. Mr. Adram, you are our support, which means you probably want to come in here and do some healing. Let's see who else we've got. Pedersen. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. This this should be good. Let's spin our map. I'm obviously worried about those um, Thinmen over there, but there's not much else we can do about them at this present moment in time. What I really want to do is do a run and gun down there. Should we try it? I mean, it's going to put me a little bit... Ooh. A little bit out of the way, but hopefully we can just like kill that guy and then worry about everyone else afterwards. Running round, running round, awesome. Fire. Him. 79 hit chance, 50% crit. This should be a death. Okay, that's good. Right now, you. Just kind of come down here and sit on Overwatch, I think. It's the thing to do, right? Okay. Is that everybody? Hopefully that's everybody. Right, we're just going to see what these three do. I, I should imagine there's some poisoning going to go on. Oh, some long-range hits. Ow. Hmm. Worried about losing my first psionics person. Yeah, like that. That's, um... 
very unfortunate, but you know, there we go. That's that's the way of things, especially with the way my game's been going recently. I have no idea why it's always just like that person that does stuff. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what's happening. Reaction shot was good. Hmm. I wonder how many more people we've got to, to deal with like that. So Britt, Britt Pedersen can dash down here or you can move here. Let's, let's just move. Okay, we're going to make a fire on that one. 93% hit chance. Should be perfect, right? Yeah. Okay, what's next? Hughes. Um, there's a dead body here. See, this is the problem. I just needed to move around here, right? Uh, so let's move him down here. And we are going to not overwatch. We're going to fire on that guy. 48% is not great, though. Perhaps we'll take out everything in the way. No. No, no, we're just going to be rubbish. Uh, sniper shot all the way down there. Come on, you can do it. This is what it's all about. Yeah. Right, is that everybody? Have we got someone else to clear out? We've got someone else to clear out. That's unfortunate, but, you know, kind of expected. Uh, where's the best piece of cover I can go for? Around here? Perhaps in here? Let's go in here. This looks like some good cover. Maybe a, uh, a reload is in order. Okay. Okay, Adrams. No idea where you're going to go. Uh, possibly all the way down here. As, uh, Pedersen really needs a bit of healing. Pedersen's just going to have a reload. These two are going to hang out here. Everything should be cool. Is that the end of my go? Well, I thought I was at the beginning of my go. Oh well, here we go. Uh, right, Pedersen. No, you're not. You're not going to do anything yet. The, we're going to heal some wounds. Okay. Four yeah, wounds. That's next to rubbish, right? Next to rubbish. Okay, that's the end of that go. Um, do we reload with Pedersen? I kind of feel like it should be. Last person's got to be over here somewhere. I have no idea where the last person's going to be. Uh, we are going to just walk up. These are all half covers. That's a bit of a shame. We're just going to walk up here and then do a reload. Hopefully everything should be all right. Uh, Hughes, not not entirely useful, mate. But you can come down here. Ah, oh, and you also need to reload. That's a little bit unfortunate. We'll try and not. Uh, try and not trigger everyone off. Ah, oh, we should reload it actually. I was like, oh, I'll just do a dash. I'll run him up, but uh, dash dashing was too much. Perhaps we can move some people up. Is there much? Oh, look, there's buildings up. I didn't realize there was quite so much up. That would be a great place to put our sniper. Um, but I don't think that's going to happen quite right now. We'll just come around here and overwatch this beautifully. Beautifully. So I wonder where this last person is. There's got to be one around some. Oh, of course. Kicks hears them. Pedersen, you are reloaded, right? And we know that they're over there somewhere, so let's just um, dash it down. Dash it down. Uh, somewhere like. Uh, here looks good. This appears to be the place that we should be going. Uh, Hughes, uh, I don't really want to get everyone so tightly packed in that they can't do anything about it. That that would be unfortunate. Uh, who else we got? You are going to just kind of move up here and reload. Oh, I am so gutted that my psionics guy got killed, or psionics girl, uh, whatever you want to say. Uh, it, it could have been a lot better. Could have been a lot better. I'm not, I'm not sure how I could have made the entry to the area any better. Maybe I could have made a, a full back at the right time. But that is the way. That is the way. I don't see anything up here. This is quite unfortunate. Uh, you can just overwatch in the corner, I suppose. Oh, look, an Adram. Okay, you're going to come down here? Yeah, why not? Let's see what happens. Hopefully we'll see someone or something. No, nothing. Who's going to hear what where? So it keeps saying over in this corner. Is it like up in this corner, down in this corner? I mean, Pedersen's kind of the ideal person to go and find out. Uh, let's go to here. Hopefully we'll see someone or something. Nope, we haven't seen anyone or anything. That is a shame. A great shame. Uh, Hughes, I don't know where we're going to send you. Mainly because I don't know where we're going to send you. You know, it's confusing. Uh, let's just put you here. Okay, Overwatch. And you are our sniper. You're next to useless to me there. What I really think I want to do is have a look down there. Look, there's, a, there's an abduction person there and everything. So I think what we're going to do is come over here. Just kind of hide up here. 
Brilliant. Who have we got left? Kicks. Can you um come down this way? I suppose. Is that a door? It's not a door. Is there, is there nowhere else to go from here? Are we just doing a pointless sweep? Uh, let's come down to here then. Maybe we'll go through this door when we're done. Uh, Adram, um, I'd like to go stick your face out that way. What does your face see? I'm kind of expecting to see something down there. Is there not? There's nothing down this way. Let's, let's go get some cover. There we go. I knew there was people around somewhere. Uh, and I think there were elite mutons, muons, whatever the name are. Um, this leaves him in a bit of a bad situation because I had to dash to get out here. Oh, I don't think we're alone out here either. Well, let's see who's going to die. Please miss. Oh, there is a miss. That's good. Anything else? No. Come on. Let's, let, let's have loads of misses. Oh, that's a shame. That is a real shame. Though, if they just do the same... Right, here we go. This should be a nice, easy... Ah, oh, you're, not, you're not my rocket guy. Dang it. Let's get through here. Nothing else we can do, really. Okay, we're going to hold fast here. Okay. Now, how are we going to spring on them, hey? How are we going to spring on them? I, I, I don't actually know, and I'm not sure how we can get through. There's no way of going through a wall here. Um, hmm, there's no way of shooting at anything or anything like this. I'm just going to hold up here. Let's turn around this way. Can we actually see out? Yeah, we can. So let's overwatch there. That should, that should be alright, right? right? Uh, Hughes. Kind of need to get you down here somewhere, don't we? So we can so you can have your go next go. Is it worth coming down here? Is that full cover in the way? I mean, I know they're all down there. But being able to fire my rocket next go would be unbelievably good. So let's try, let's try that. I know I'm probably saying goodbye to my guy here. Um, Alright, what can we do about you? Well, you... Ideally, you want to come down here, right? And then next round, we'll be able to unload some uh, some health fury on, on people. Uh, kicks. We're actually taking you up top here. I'm not sure if you can lean out the window to get a better shot, though. Is this a thing? That's a dash. Should we run and gun? We can run and gun, but I'm not sure if it actually gets me a shot. Oh, well. Let's try it. But at the speed of death. Yeah, moving at the speed of death. Let's come up here. Ooh. Do we get do we get any views? We've got no views. Uh, okay. That's a shame. That is actually a real shame. I'm not sure how we're supposed to deal with that then. Um, I suppose we're going to have to just run him down at some point. We're going to have to overwatch though. Okay. Who else do we have? Is that it? Is that everyone? Let's watch the grenades come out towards us. Are, are they cycling? Are they not? Oh, they're just running away. Hmm. Well, well, well. I wonder if it's even worth popping a a rocket down here. Should we try it? As it's probably going to be the only chance we get. Shot is blocked. Shot is blocked. Oh, look, come on! I want to. I want to be down here. <laughs> what is wrong with you? I just want to push it up that way. Is there like a maximum range or something? There we go. That should do well. I'm hoping that does well. I really do. Do we get anything or anyone? Do we perhaps put a hole in the wall? So let's just overwatch down this way. Someone should be able to do something about that. Kicks. I don't I don't know what we're going to do with you, my friend. What, what I really want to... Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Um, what we really want to do is get you down here somehow. But I'm not sure if that's going to be a bad plan or not. Uh, we could dash all the way down here. Shame I've used my run and gun already. Okay, so with that in mind, let's just dash our way down to, like, here. Oh, bye-bye, kicks. Down he goes. I'm just not sure what to do with these people. Pedersen. See, a run and gun would be ideal here, but I'm not sure if this is going to put me in big trouble or not. I feel big trouble coming, but I want to finish this level. I really want to finish this level. Okay, so we can see one. We're going to fire at him. 61% hit chance. Ah, well, so much for Pedersen, she's going to get it full in the face. Kicks can't even come out to help. Um, uh, uh. Okay, we're just going to have to leave him there. Okay. Uh, Adram, you're going to come out here. 
and you're going to overwatch so that if anyone tries any nasty stuff, you're going to get them. Anyone else for anything else? No, okay. Yeah, you run away. So this one's coming forwards. Is he going to do anything? Is he going to shoot Pedersen? This is the question. Yeah, right in the face. That really hurt. Eight points is always a big hit. It's always a big hit. Um, not quite enough to be able to actually take me out, but it's enough for me to worry about. So we can fire around this way. I'm not sure if I get the extra extra damage with the more people in sight. I can't remember if that is an actual thing or not. Um, wow, that wasn't overly useful. Uh, can we dash down here? We can, but it is just as useless. Can we dash into here? No. All right, let's find someone else. Um, Adrams. All right. We can't run you around here, but we can sort of move you here, and then you can give some healing to Pedersen. That might be a good idea. Do it. Man up and get back out there. Yeah, no, you, you man up and get back out there. Let's see what happens. Uh, who else have we got? This is my heavy guy. He's he's only so useful, you know. Um, oh, does does he have a run and gun? He doesn't have a run and gun, though we could move him down here. I'm really worried about Pedersen. If she takes another 16 points to the face, she is done for. So, hmm, outside plots. Where, where can I go? This is the question. Where can I go? Can't get round there. Hmm, here and then a ghost? Is that something I can do? Does this take my mo uh, last one turn or turn on the back? Uh, ooh, ooh, I'm invisible. Okay, ghost mode. What, come and stand here? Is that something I can do? Or is, is, is here something I can do? I, I'm, I'm feeling here. We'll, we'll see what happens. This, this is a test of the equipment, right? Uh, Mr. Hughes. I wish I had a rocket left, but there's not much else we can do. So we're just going to move you up bit by bit. Completely uncovered. But, you know, what else are we going to do? And we'll move the sniper plasma up here. I'm going to swap him over here and he can overwatch because there's nothing else that he can do, which is a little bit... I'm, I'm not sure how to deal with this corner situation. If anybody has any, like, ideas for, like, tactics and stuff... Oh, bye-bye, Pedersen. Oh, yeah, no, she is a goner right now. Oh, no. Killed? What happened to my, um, you know... Stronger, stronger regens and stuff like that. That's rubbish. I'm panicked and I'm revealed. Ah. Oh. So we're gonna fire at this guy. Twenty-two percent good shot. I mean, what, what the hell? Negative damage. Hmm. Yeah, not, not going very well. Not going very well at all. It's not exactly much I can do against it, though. No, I'm not allowed to overwatch with my pistol. So, something very bad is going on here. Things are out after me, I'm sure of it. Uh, oh, well, okay, well, I want to kind of hide here. And then we're going to fire at this guy, right? 68% hit chance. X-ray neutralized. Yeah, it's one down, but it's still not great. Well, let's see what's happening. We've got someone panicking, someone dead. Everything's just bad, really. Everything is just bad, really. Okay, let's run up here. And we're going to fire at this guy. 48% hit chance. It's a lot lower than I was hoping for, actually. A lot lower than I was hoping for. Um... Constantly confused about what I can do. Let's come down here. Let's see. Let's see what happens. We've got no one to fire at. Ah, oh, death is coming for me. Death is coming. Um, let's just kind of hide around here. Maybe. Um, oh, I'm not sure what we're doing here. We're just kind of. Plowing forwards, doing our best at not being totally wiped out, but I feel like a, a wipeout is coming re relatively shortly, especially with all these guys down here. Um, could probably say goodbye to our people soon. Oh, there's two of them. What? I thought there was just one. Oh, well, let's just get him. Well, let's see what he does. 
That's fine. We can deal with that. What, is he running? Is he staying? He's staying. Okay, right. We're just going to carry on moving down, taking our shots as we can. Uh, fire at this guy. Do it, do it, do it. No, not even any hollow targeting. What a rubbish way to do things. Uh, finally, this guy gets to come walk up here, be part of the, be part of the party. Party, party. Uh, can't fire with the pistol. So we're just going to have to overwatch it, I suppose. Uh, kicks all the way down. Takes a shot at the end. Do it. Not enough to kill him. Oh, my word. All right, so who's next? Uh, Adram. D not, not ideal, mate. Not ideal. Uh, this guy, however. Boom. No. Can't. What? I didn't reload. I didn't actually reload, did I? Damn it! What a useless thing to do. Uh, you've already fired. Um, you got dashes up to here. Okay. We can't fire on him from here. It's poor. It's poor. Uh, okay. Well, let's just carry on. Kicks is definitely uh, taking a bit that big style. But what else can we do? Hey, what else can we do? Seriously, if anybody has an idea, let me know. Uh, let's use this guy. We're going to fire. 58. This 58% chance business is rubbish. I mean. Oh, wow. This terrible. Terrible. Let's just sit here. And this should be enough to finish him off. Oh, wow. Excellent work. All objectives complete. Yeah, all objectives complete, but we lost two operatives. This is terrible. And, and one of them was our most highly trained unit. Not the best. Not the best. We seem to be losing people left, right, and center. Um, India is, of course, just a, a horrible, swirling red cloud of bad. Um, achievement unlocked, Oppenheimer. Well, I don't know who's the guy who developed the, the, the bomb, but why, why am I got the Oppenheimer? Oh yeah, Operation Lost Calm. We have lost two people and, oh god, so much more stuff going bad. Did we get any Illyrium? We got no Illyrium, so this is terrible. Panic has increased across South America, but Japan has decreased. Remember. And with that, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time where, I don't know, we're probably just going to end up losing all our guys and failing their game or something. But anyway, I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!